we're going to build a layout now for the MLK soundboard app. So I've switched over to the XML view and this is a representation of what the screen is going to look like. Our layout is going to be quite simple. We're just going to have a, an image here of MLK and when the user presses the image the speech will start to play and when the user presses the image again the speech will stop. Now uh, normally we have lots of different components on here and uh, in some ways that makes the presentation of an image a little bit easier. Uh, let me show you the problem you run into if you just have a single image view object here. I'm going to grab this image view and I'm going to drag it up here to this uh, screen and uh, I'm going to load it up with the MLK image. So to do that I'm just going to double click on that. Source window shows up and then I click on here. Uh, the images as a reminder are stored in the MIPMAP directory and I'm going to pick this MLK image and I'm going to click OK. Now you see the image is really small here. Uh, now if you try to uh, drag the image this way uh, you see it, it's going to work fine in the in the width direction but now look what happens when you try to uh, set it in the length direction. Now this actually gets easier if you have some other items here for example if I were to drag a button down here then when I click on this you see if I reshape this now you can see that the the box reshapes you see that but when the button is gone uh, you see that this thing just wants to uh, wrap its content. Now one way, can, one way we can get around this is we can make it fill up the entire parent. So that's what I'm going to do. Uh, I'm going to uh, come over here and change both of these to fill parent. And what that does is it takes up the whole screen and that's what we want here. Uh, the other thing you want to just make sure of is that under the uh, scale type uh, you want to set that to fit center. Now in this case uh, it, it didn't need to because the image was nice and large anyway but sometimes you'll see that even if you uh, set the image view to be quite large the, the image itself will remain tiny and the way to fix that is to do this fit center here under the scale type. Okay so we got this image here. Uh, the next thing I want to do is I want to set the property clickable to be true because we want to make sure that uh, we can take some action when the image is clicked. That's basically the entire layout for our app. The one last thing I need to do is to change the ID of this image view item uh, to something more descriptive in the code. So I'm going to call it uh, MLK uh, underscore uh, IV for image view. Uh, let me use small letters since it's going to be a variable in the code. MLK IV, there we go.